17-year-old Megan Werner doesn't have a driver's license yet, but she's a pilot. Her You Dream Global nonprofit helped a diverse group of 20 African teenagers assemble a light aircraft. Werner and some of her colleagues left Cape Town this week for a round-trip flight to Cairo. If you're a teenager and you already built a plane, you can say to yourself, well, I built a plane when I was a teenager. What else can I do? And then for the teenagers flying it across Africa, just to be able to make a difference and show people what is possible is really inspiring. Agnes Semela helped to assemble the fuselage for the kit aircraft, which the teens built under qualified adult supervision. I know for a fact that my team did their best, their absolute best, and I'm very confident that this airplane will make it to Cairo and back. During the maiden flight event, the South African teens saw their plane fly for the first time. Seeing that now it's no longer like about like adult people engaging in this industry, but also young people can get involved in such projects. I think it, it's going to inspire a lot of people to actually join aviation. With both her parents working in aviation, Werner's interest in flying is no surprise. The plane is crazy enough. It doesn't need to be that crazy that my daughter must fly across Africa by herself. So I thought, no, I'll go and check that she's okay. Because I've got a bit more experience than what she has. And um, I'm there just to support them to make the right decisions. For safety, two adult pilots will fly a second plane similar to the one the teens built for the trip from South to North Africa and back. Obviously fatigue plays a big role that we need to manage with the students um, so that we can make sure that they are always awake, that they're always sharp to be able to make the right decisions. This is going to stretch their limits. The U Dream Global team will travel some 12,000 kilometers for the round trip flight with stops in 11 countries. Along the way, they'll take other teenagers up in the plane to inspire them to also reach for greater heights. Marisa de Klerk for VOA News, Ekenhof, South Africa.